What is up, everybody? Thank you so much for clicking and landing on this page. What I'm going to do is simply just give you um, some real, real live online social media examples of, of what, what people do, um, what small business owners do, a lot of real estate agents that are landing on this page. Um, I'm going to show you just based on real live social media examples of what other agents do when they market their properties and how these landing pages are just so, so game changing and so simple at the same time. Every single one of you guys should be should be marketing your business this way, your listings, your open houses, any free offer. Um, I coach a lot of a lot of real estate agent, agents. And what we do is we run Facebook ads. We target a local area, run Facebook ads and give away a buyer guide or a seller guide. Right. Simply doing basic videos on your cell phone, educating people on what it takes to sell. And the call to action is to click and go and download your free seller guide right or a free buyer guide and a lot of you guys that are maybe maybe doing different businesses what's that what's that one offer that you can give away right in this case with real estate I happen to work with a lot of you guys. It's a buyer guide or a seller guide. Now, what I have listed below on the page. So if you look, if you just scroll down a little bit more, um, what I'm giving you is, is four funnels that I built, that I that I designed, that I put together that are so simple. They're basic templates that once you import them into your account, which I'm going to walk you through how to do it right now, um, you're going to be able to edit it, change it, really customize it to your liking. Um, and once you activate your 14-day trial, you get me. So what I'll do is I'll email you my calendar. We'll jump on some strategy calls. I'll give you my time for free and we'll take these templates and customize them to your liking. Um, but, but you can see there, you can click on each one, open house, a seller guide one, a listing one. Look at some of these funnels. They're so beautiful and they're so basic. It's two pages. I'm going to show you, we're going to do some, some real live walkthroughs right now. Um, what I want to do is I want to show you some examples of what everyone does and, 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 and how you're going to now not be doing that. And now I'm going to show you a tool where it's going to allow you to not market the way everybody else is marketing. Um, and then I'm going to show you the actual pages. And then, and then I'm going to walk you through activating a 14-day 14, 14 trial. And then I'm going to walk you through um, importing your free funnel. So these are four funnels that I have. And these are basic templates. Um, a lot of the copy, a lot of the design is already done for you. All you got to do is import them into your account and, and customize them again to, to how you like them. But I'm going to show you how simple this can be. Um, so let's get started. What I'm going to show you here, you guys, is, is just a live shot of the news feed, right? And this applies for everything online, you guys. If you're a business owner, you're, you're, you're marketing your business on social media, whether it's Facebook, Instagram, LinkedIn, TikTok, whatever. You're running Google ads, you're building a YouTube channel, whatever. This applies to, to those that are organic marketing, just simply posting all over social media. And this applies to those that are running ads, for sure, landing pages. Now, why I'm so fired up about this software that I'm going to be walking you guys through is 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 the fact that I've been on this software since 2018. I've been recommending it to all of my real estate clients since 2018 because I truly believe these are the only tools that you need to really build a huge business. Three basic tools, and it starts with landing pages. But what I'm going to do here is I'm going to show you what what everyone's doing and and why no one's achieving the goal, which is capturing the lead turning that lead into a client, closing a deal, making a sell, whatever it may be. But I'm going to show you why, because most are simply just not, not marketing the correct way. They have the right intention. They even have the right content, but the call to action is what's missing. That's where landing pages come in into play. So what I'm going to show you here is an actual example of, of the newsfeed, right? So again, this could be any newsfeed. I could be on any platform. It's all the same thing. As I scroll through the Facebook newsfeed and I just kind of see what my friends are up to, um, seeing what everyone's posting, and then all of a sudden I come across a sponsored ad. There's the video. Down below is the learn more button. As I click on that learn more button, he's taking me off of Facebook to a landing page. That's all this is. Look how basic this page is. Um, rank daddy, get your free SEO agency mini course below. See, so his quote unquote offer is a free mini course. That's what he's, that's what he's giving up front right? That's, that's his value proposition. That's what he's, that, that's what he's dangling in front of people's face up front, right? It's a carrot. They're just dangling in front of the, in, in, in front of the, in front of the person. That is the ethical bribe, right? Um, that's the offer. So in exchange, what happens? I click this button, get your free, get your free course and boom, 
there goes the lead capture. This could be a basic page on anything. It could be a listing. It could be an open house. I'm going to show you some of my funnels that I already have done for you. In fact, if you click on the, on the buttons below, they're all right there below the, the landing pages. Right now, I'm going to talk about the landing pages. So, so here, I'm just giving you, giving you kind of the insight of what real successful marketers do. And again, this could be on any platform. Um, this guy's bringing me over to a page to give me a free course in exchange for my information. Let's scroll down and see if we can see one more. Um, here goes a listing. And again, everyone, this is all, these are all my Facebook friends. This is all organic marketing. You know what? Let's just, let, let me show you one more. I'm going to come back up to Heather. Shout out to Heather. I'm going to come back up to her, but let me click on one more that I, that I don't know an actual ad. Okay. Look, so here's another one, right? Sponsored. There's the text. There's the video. There's learn more. As I click on learn more, I'm coming off of Facebook to a landing page. These are this. This is all we're doing, you guys. So marketers online, um, people that that are that are that are building marketing companies or even approaching you guys for marketing services. That's all we're really doing is running ads to a page like this that captures the lead. And even those that are that are buying leads from Zillow or buying leads from Realtor.com, what do you think they're doing? All they're doing is spending millions and millions of dollars on online marketing. They are literally running ads on Google specifically, getting people to click, come over come, and, and come over to a page where there's simply one freaking button and that's how you capture the lead. That's it. This guy's going straight for a call. So he took me, he took me from his Facebook ad, right? His video, his 44 second video, taking me straight to a page where now he's asking to jump on a call. Here's his one single page. There's one, one green button and that's it. Text, text, videos, one green button. That's it. And he's going, there's another video of him. A basic page. This is what we call a long form sales page. It's one page. Yes, it's long. It keeps going, it keeps going, but there's only one green button right? It, there, there's no contact us. There's no button to meet the team. There's no 15 other listings. None of that. Um, there's one call to action button and it's, and it's right there. So as I click, he's going straight for the call. This guy's probably getting a bunch of appointments, a bunch of appointments running ads to a landing page. So, so that's live in the newsfeed. Let me show you. Let's go back up to Heather. Look, here's the problem with organic posting. That's why, that's why a lot of you guys are landing here. You're looking at just simply simply activate a 14 day trial, right? Jump into this landing page software thing and, and, and really tear it apart and, and really see if it's worth the hundred bucks a month, right? It's a joke what, what, what we're paying for this, you guys, the, the, because of the amount of business that you get in return, it's a joke. This is a, an actual write-off, first of all, um, and it's an investment. So it's a monthly investment. It's not even an expense. This is what we need online to build a business, to capture leads, to 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 nurture leads, and to really get people to schedule appointments. Um, and, and just to conduct business overall, we need software. This is the one software, you guys. So in this case, here's what every agent is doing. Okay, so now I'm going to talk specific, specifically to, 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 real, to realtors and, and agents. Um, and if you've spoken to me, I, if, if we got on any social media call, as I mentioned on my first call, and I probably even direct messaged you, if you got if you got in touch with me through a direct message as well, I mentioned it in my direct message on how every single friend I have on Facebook, every single one of them is a real estate agent, right? So I see what thousands and thousands of agents do when it comes to marketing their business. Out of my 4.7 every single one is an agent. And so it's been this way since 2016. As, as some of you guys know my story, um, I was a lender. I jumped, in, I jumped into mortgages in 20, 2010 um, here in San Diego, crushing it for the state of California, crushing it for the state of Washington. Successfully just, just succeeded um, in mortgages from 2010 to 2016. Knew nothing about the industry, was not licensed, did not come from a real estate background. I happened to have an advantage though because my, it was my best friend who it was his company. And it was, it was my best friend for about 10 years at that point. It was his mortgage company. He literally brought me under his wings and taught me everything about the industry. So my run was six years and that's kind of, that's, I just couldn't stand it for many, many reasons. Um, so I jump out, I jump out in 2016 and I start consulting real estate agents on social media marketing and Facebook advertising. And so in 2016, some of you guys know this story. My whole strategy to get in touch with agents and brokers was to not cold call every agent, not to even 
go back to my existing network and, 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 and hit up people that I did mortgages with and say, Hey, John, I know I got a, I, I did a mortgage for your buyer, but Hey, I'm doing marketing now. Can I help you with this? It's like, dude, I didn't want to be that guy. Right. I didn't want to do traditional advertising at all. And at that point I was still even, I was still learning. Right. I was, I didn't even know exactly what I was going to teach agents. It's not like I had a social media marketing background at all. I had a marketing background, but social media was barely starting to scale. Right. And so, and so, 2016, my whole my whole strategy to get you guys was to to get in front of you to even build a relationship with you guys to connect with you guys was to do it here on Facebook. So what I did in 2016 is I literally started requesting not, nothing but agents. I removed all of my real friends and family, my mother, my brother, my cousins. The only person who's on this 4.7 is and, and, and who is not a wife. I mean, who is not a wife? Oh, my gosh. The only person out of the 4.7. Um, 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 uh, 4.7 list who is not a real estate agent is my wife. She's the only one. And she happens to be, where is she at? She, 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 she's somewhere. Oh yeah. She's somewhere on this. She's somewhere on this list. She's the only one out of the 4.7 who is not a real estate agent. Okay. And it's been this way since 2016. Gosh, I can't find her. She's too, she's probably too far down, but, but it was in 2016. Right. So, so as I, as I got, got up to a thousand, I, I removed all of my real friends, put them on Instagram, because again, my whole strategy was to fill up 5,000 with agents. That was the strategy. Remove everyone. If you're not an agent, get off my list, right? Don't take it personal. I'm going to connect with you on Instagram. We'll still stay in touch there. That's what I literally did. Um, so, the reason why I'm even bringing it up here, you guys, is because in 2016, 2017, 2018, 2019, I now have a few thousand friends and every single one is an agent. When you connect like that and you follow everyone who literally has the same job, you start to see how everyone's marketing their business and you start to realize that everyone's doing the same damn thing. Okay. That's what I realized. And so that's what allowed me to really tear it apart, analyze it, see the pros and cons, see what they're all doing versus how they could be doing it to even attract even more business, right? And then I started putting the, piece, the pieces of the puzzle together and really build, b- building something out of it. And, and now today I have hundreds of clients. I have, I have so many reviews on my, on, on my business page alone from all of my, all of my awesome clients um, over here. So if you click on my link, come to my, my reviews, I have 112 um, that I see over here, it's like, man, it's like, I'm so thankful for, and, and majority of them, all of them are agents. Some of them will find me on YouTube and, and we'll connect and I'll still teach them Facebook ads and, and landing pages. But the majority of, of, of the 112, for example, are, are agents, people that I've been working with since 2016, right? So it was in 2018 when I came across Kartra and, 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 and I started really, really understanding the, the, the importance of a landing page, of a simple sales funnel to get people to click Enter your world, give up their information in exchange for something value. And that's how you can build your business. And that's how you do build a business online. It was a game changer. Like it was a complete game changer once I really went all in with, with, with lead capture, right? Which is why we're here. We're all trying to build a business. We're all trying to build a brand. We're trying to build an audience. We need to, we need lead flow. We need to know how to, how, how the pieces work. Like we need, to, we, need, we need to know how to put it all together. And I'm telling you, it's right here, you guys. It's right here. So I'm super fired up for you to be here. Um, let me, um, yeah, so let's get back to Heather real quick. So Heather happens to be a friend of mine, right? We're on Facebook. This is my newsfeed. This is how the majority of agents market their business, right? So, so here's here. And again, if we spoken before, then, then I would have, I would have touched on, um, the fact that, and, and I would have, this is, this is what I would have said on my first call, right? So if some of you guys were on, on one call with me and we were talking about all this stuff, then I, then you remember, right? How, how, how I was, I was bringing up that as we scale our friend count up, the problem with organic marketing and the problem with marketing like this is the fact that as we as we scale our friend count up on any platform, none of these people live in our area, right? Heather is marketing this property. I'm her friend, right? And, and she's posting this listing and she's out there in Wiley, Texas. I'm in San Diego, California. It's like, I'm one of her friends over here and I'm probably one of 3,000, right? After you get past 200, maybe 300 um, over here, number 301, number 302, number 303, friend number 1000, friend number 1700, if you're like me, friend number 4.7, none of these people know you, none of these people live in your area. So as we have 
2.9 thousand friends on our Facebook page, as we have that many people following us on Instagram, as we have that many people connected with us on LinkedIn, as we have 3,000 people following us on TikTok, these are people who live outside of your area. They're not even in your state, nor are they planning on moving there. So, 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 and that just happens to be a fact. If I was a local business, think of it, you guys, wherever you're at right now, right now watching this video, wherever you are physically at, if I was a local business owner here in San Diego, now you guys are real estate, a lot of you guys watching this are real estate. So I'm not, I'm not going to say I'm real estate. Let's say I'm, let's say, let's say, let's say I'm plumbing. I'm a local business owner. I'm a plumber. We're friends on Facebook. I'm out here doing plumbing work, talking about my plumbing business. I'm a local business owner talking about these jobs that I, that I have and all these amazing clients and how we get our job done with the most amazing service. You're out there in Nebraska. You're out there in Texas. You're out there in Florida. You're out there in New Mexico. You're out there in freaking another country. Do you care about my plumbing work that I got going on in San Diego? You're, we're friends on Facebook. Yeah, you can you could see my picture and okay, like it. But does anybody care what I got going on locally? At all. Not at all, right? Not at all. And it applies to your real estate business. Yes, people are relocating. Yes, you never know where your next client's coming from. Yes, I get it. But that's not marketing. That's not marketing. That's kind of just throwing spaghetti against the wall and seeing what sticks. That's not marketing, right? So, so, but, but at the same time, at the same time, since all of you guys that are watching this are going to continue to post organic anyways, all I'm saying is that there should have been a link right here that leads me to a landing page. There's no call to action. The only call to action is the phone number when no one's calling. First of all, I'm in San Diego. I don't care about this listing. All your friends, majority of them that are seeing it, they don't care either. Before I liked it, before I liked it, she had four other people who liked it as well. And one person commented. This Tina is probably her coworker, right? It's probably her coworker because again, out of your 3,000 friends, you got 300 that you actually know, right? So, so Tina is probably one of the 300, and that's fine. But, but if you look at your personal friend list, do you even have 300? Like, I'm, I, I've been in San Diego forever. When I started removing all of my real friends on my – this is how I know this. This is how I know this because I've been in San Diego my whole life. I know everyone. But still on Facebook, I've been on Facebook forever and a day. Still on Facebook, it was really only 250 that I ended up removing that were my actual real cousins, uncles, aunts, in-laws, mother, brother, friends I went to high school with, people that I work with. In my actual office, I was in mortgages, right? It's like only a handful, right? So the four that like the page, it's probably her uncle, probably her aunt, probably her girlfriend and her husband, right? It's like, dude, this is not how we market. But again, all I'm saying is that if you are going to market, there should have been a link. There should have been a link. So what you're getting with this, once you activate your 14-day trial, is I'm giving you a listing, a listing funnel. So imagine this. First of all, I'd be running an ad. I'd be running an ad. I'd be targeting that local area. I'd be running a Facebook ad. I'd be running an Instagram ad. I'd be targeting that local area, first of all. But again, if I was just going to post it all over the damn place and spam all these groups that I'm in involved in online on Facebook, okay, whatever. Put a freaking link. There should have been a link. No one's calling. Put a link, right? So here's what would happen. If it was an ad, for sure, tons of people would have been clicking the link. But if it's organic, then 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 it still is what it is somewhat, because, again, most that are seeing this don't care. We're not in the area. Right. So so let's just say there was a link. Here's the basic link that link that you're getting one of the templates that you guys are getting. So as I click out, it came straight to this page right here. And this is just a template, you guys. We're going to change out the background image. We're going to change the blue to your favorite color. Change out the image to you guys. Change your logo. Basic reviews, one button. This is your basic listing funnel. A headline, the image in the background of that beautiful property, a few bullet points, view all 17 photos now. This is how you capture the lead, you guys. So again, shout out to Heather, but, 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 but I should be clicking. All I'm doing is clicking and I'm seeing the image. And then again... This all could have been on a page, and I'm going to send this link to, 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 to Heather. So shout out to Heather. I love you, Heather, but it's like, dude, where's the link? You know you know what I'm talking about, Heather. Where is the link, right? So with an ad, she would add a ton of people, a ton of people clicking on the link and opting in, right? They're opting in. They're coming over to this one single page, right? View all 17 photos now. 
There goes the name and email. Send me all the details now. Boom, an email triggers. So tool number one is the landing page, okay? Tool number one is the landing page. If you scroll down a little bit more on the page, you're gonna also see email automation. Your email autoresponder is your second tool. And this applies for every business out there. If you're a small business owner, medium-sized business owner, this applies to every single one of you, no matter what industry you're in. Um, in this case, I'm talking specifically to agents because I service a lot of agents. Um, and this is as basic as it gets. This is the flow. It's so freaking powerful and it's so simple. Um, so the moment that lead came in, an email would have triggered right away, right? That's email number one. It would have triggered right away. That is tool number two. Tool number one is the landing page. Tool number two is the email autoresponder. I need to have email automation. I need emails to continue to nurture that lead without me, right? I need to, I need to write the emails once and then just program it in a way where emails trigger every day, for example, right? So in this case, a lead just came in an email would have triggered right away. Hey, Dave, this is John. Hey, thank you so much. For, thank you so much for inquiring on this beautiful listing, 777 Plaza Boulevard. Click here for all the details, right? That first email needs to trigger instantly, okay? Now here's the flow. So that's tool number two, the email autoresponder. But here's the flow and here's the video. Here's the way this goes. Jot this down. Jot this down and just make mental note of what I'm going to tell you right here. This is the thank you page, right? This, this is a lead that just came in off of a listing. We just saw Heather's listing. I clicked. I straight came over to the page. I entered my name and email. Where did it go? I, I entered my name and email. Now I land on the second page. Jot this down, four bullet points. Number one, right here, I'm saying thank you. So what I would do is I'd make a, I'd pull out my cell phone and do a simple selfie style, one minute video that I would put here on the second page. The moment they opted in on the listing, the moment they opted in on an open house, the moment they opted in to download my free seller's guide, right? There's a video that goes on this second page and it's the same four bullet points for no matter what it is. Um, and again, if you're not real estate, it's the same thing. The same full bu four bullet points apply to your business as well. And here's what it is. Number one, thank you. The moment they land here, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you for, thank you for inquiring on 777 Plaza Boulevard. My name is David. I'm the listing agent of this beautiful property. Let me give you a little bit more details. And right. So, so number one, I'm thanking them. Number two, I'm introducing myself. Number three, I'm saying, hey, guys, go check your email because I just sent you all the specs. I sent you the details. I sent you the images. I sent you even a, a, a video of a drone that we used to film it all. So make sure you check your email. And by the way, check your email over the next few days because over the next few days, I'm going to have some pocket listings that are not even on the market that I'm going to be able, be able to email to my VIP members. So make sure you check for my email, right? So that would be number three. Number three, I'm saying, hey, go check my email. I just sent you all the details. And by the way, continue to look for my emails because I have a ton of great content coming your way. And in this case, I can continue to send that per person listings. I can put them on a drip and, and send them future listings from this point on because I got their email, right? So number three, check your email. Number four is when I'm going for the close. This is how you automate your appointments. This is how you really take it, take it to the next level with your, with your, with your automation and appointments. Number four is when I would say, hey, guys, and by the way, and I'd be doing all this from a cell phone selfie video, you guys, this is basic stuff. And it would just and, and we would just park it right here on this second page. So number four, I would say, hey, guys, and by the way, this property is definitely not going to last. So if you click the button below, it will take you straight to my calendar where you can schedule your private showing. That's it. Those are the three tools. I need a landing page to capture the lead. I need an email autoresponder to trigger the emails. And I need an online calendar where it's stupid proof and someone can just click and schedule a call. That's it. And the calendar is obviously based on your schedule. So there's no conflicting of, of interest or conflicting of times or anything like that. No, you would set up the calendar and, 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 and that'd be all based on your schedule. Same thing applies for an open house. If I was running an ad on an open house or if I was posting anything regarding an open house, let me show you how, how powerful this is. So this is a Facebook group that I have. Um, everyone posts their listings, right? So another one just listed. This is what everyone does, you guys. Here, here's, here's Nikki. Shout out to Nikki. But she's posting this video, 30 second, 32 second video. There's all the text. Here is the dot com. So if I click on that dot com, where is Nikki taking me? She's taking me to your typical replicated real estate website that everyone gets from their broker. 
This is not where you drive traffic. This is not a page that's going to capture leads at all, like at all at all. Like she just posted information on a listing, but when I go to the link, it's not even that listing. And, and so if she was running an actual ad to this page, she'd be burning money, literally. Um, not only because the information of the, of the listing is not even here, but not, it's not even that. It's not even really that. It's actually not even that. It's for the fact that it's a full-blown website. So that's what most of you guys are, are, are marketing is a full-blown website. No Facebook tr um, pixel tracking it. No custom link. Actually, that is her custom link. That's her custom link, and that's fine. But she doesn't have any Facebook tracking because I can see it from right here. But it's a full-blown website. So what happens is when you run an ad on the listing, if I were to run an ad on this listing, people are clicking, coming over to the page. And before you know it, they're over here looking at buyers. They're over here looking at Roundup. They're over here reading our blog. They're scrolling down and they're... Um, they're connecting with us on LinkedIn. It's like, dude, I just spent money on that. Why in the hell do I want them coming to my Twitter or my Pinterest or my LinkedIn? It's like, no, dude, like when you bring in a click to a page, and again, this is not just for, this is, this is specifically for advertising, but it's also for all this organic posting that you guys are doing anyways. So, so, so not, Rather than taking them to a full-blown website, you guys, you're taking them to a landing page where you can where you can capture the lead. So, so back to this one, tur turnkey ready, Nadomas. I don't know how to pronounce that, whatever. But but open house, look, open house, open house, seven two twenty two, open house eleven a.m. So as I click on the link, as I click, where is she taking me? She's taking me to the actual MLS link, right? I'm pretty sure that's what this is. She's giving me all of the information, all of this information, and she did not even capture the lead. So this link up here is definitely not her custom domain. So Facebook wouldn't even let her run an ad to this page. Um, there's a Facebook pixel tracking the page, but I'm willing to bet that's not hers. It's probably um, prospect, prospect, O R R E M, Metro, Metro List, whoever they are. So it's probably it's probably the MLS. So it's it's probably their pixel tracking the visit, right? It's not it's not hers, but this is where everyone's taking you guys. This is where everyone's taking people. Is to is to is to websites that 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 don't capture anything for you. See, so look, Jeffrey, don't miss the don't miss your opportunity on this awesome home here today, gone tomorrow. Homes are still moving fast. Call. And so, so this is his listing, 395. All he has is a phone number. Um, there's a dot .info. So as I click on his website address, he's bringing me to a full-blown website that tells me nothing about that specific listing, right? Or that specific open house. Now, all of a sudden, he's showing me four others. It's like, this is what agents are doing. And I truly believe you're just, you're just shooting yourself in the foot. That's all. And if you were actually spending ads on this, spending, spending money on this stuff and running ads, you're really burning a hole in your wallet because it's not doing nothing for you. These pages are not doing for you. You need something, you need to dumb it down. That's the problem with real estate websites. They're too damn beautiful. They're too damn informative. They're too amazing. There's too much information. That's the problem. So that's why you, you got you to dummy proof it. And, and if this is the one listing you're talking about, right, go back up to the open house. If this is the one open house, shout out to Deborah. But if this is the one open house you're, 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 you're promoting and talking about, okay, cool. When I click, take me to a page before showing me all this information, man, you gave me all of the information before you even asked for mine, right? I got it all. So what am I going to typically do? I'm gone. Exit out, right? That's not the property for me, Right. That's what that's what most most online browsers will do, right? Because we're just browsing. If I'm just browsing for a property, browse, 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 whatever catches my attention, right? I'm clicking, clicking, clicking. Oh, I got all the information for that. I don't need them no more, right? When it's like, man, you you shot yourself in the foot again. If you were running an ad on that, you would have missed out on a million leads, literally, literally. So 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 if I'm seeing if I'm seeing that post, and I'm clicking. And I'm coming straight to one single page, open house, Saturday and Sunday, one of four, right? There's the address. There's a few bullet points on the property, right? It's the same page as the other one. 
one single button, right? As that lead comes to the page, they enter their name and email. They opt in. They want information on the open house. They then land on the second page, right? Two pages. That's all there is. Right when they land here, again, a simple video on my cell phone. Um, from my cell phone. Hey guys, this is David. Thank you so much for inquiring on our open house coming up this Saturday and Sunday from one of four. My name is David. I'm the listing agent of this beautiful property. Let me give you a little bit more details and let you know why you're going to want to make sure you bring you and your family to this open house coming up this weekend. Let me tell you a little bit more about it. So the same four bullet points apply on this second page. Number one, thank you. Number two, I'm introducing myself. Number three, check your email because I just sent you all the details on the on, on the open house. I sent you pictures. I sent you a map on how to get here. I sent you freaking all the details you're going to need to know for you and your family. So make sure you check your email, right? That's number three. I'm telling them to check their email. And then number four, I'm going for the close. I'm saying, hey guys, and by the way, this property is obviously not going to last. So if you click the button below, it will take you straight to my calendar where you can schedule your private showing. That's it, you guys. Like, it's that basic. So if I was running an ad targeting my local area, getting those local people to click, enter their information, come to my page, they land on the second page where I'm now getting them to schedule a call. That's all it's about is literally running ads. So that's what I'm saying. Activate your 14-day trial now, right? Activate your 14-day trial. I'll give you a huge crash course on all this stuff. I'll dump all these funnels on you. I have the open house funnel. I have the um, the um, the listing funnel. I have the the um, the seller guide funnel. This right here, when you don't have an open house and when you don't have a listing, what I teach and what I'm going to coach coach you on how to do is to simply pick one: buyers or sellers. Who is the avatar that we're going to go after? Right? Who's that one avatar? And that's the thing about marketing. You have to you have to specify your avatar. You have to specify the person that you want to bring bring value to. You have to really narrow it into one person. Stop marketing to everyone real estate. No. Even though you can do it all, you're the jack of all trades. You got you're, you're the jack of all trades. You 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 you've been in the industry forever. You can help everybody. I get it. But when it comes to marketing, it's best to narrow in to narrow in and talk to one person. I'm either going to be talking to the buyer or I'm going to be talking to the seller. Pick one, okay? And this is for your marketing. This is for your online branding. This is for, for, for the positioning and the authority that you're going to have in your space. People are going to come to you because you teach one thing and you're good at it, right? And just like a surgeon. A surgeon does not practice. He's not a pediatrician. He's not a eye doctor. Uh, he, he's not, he, he, he doesn't do all these different things. He focuses on one thing. That's why he's the highest paid doctor on the planet, a surgeon, right? Cause they're so special in their, in their craft. They, they do one thing and one thing only, right? That's how you got to look at your marketing, focus on one thing, because again, it makes it not again, but, but, but mainly because it makes it easy for, for, for you to think of content. Now, all I got to do is think about one thing to talk about, like what, what can be the one thing that I could talk about when it comes to sellers? What could be the one thing that I could talk about forever when it comes to buyers? So it makes it easier for you to think of content when there's only, when there's only one thing I need to be making, making content around, right? And then it makes it easy for Facebook. If you're running ads on Instagram or Facebook, it makes it easy for Facebook to capture the data because you keep targeting the same type of person. Facebook picks up on that. Therefore, Facebook goes out there and finds you more of the same type of person. And in this case, it could be a homeowner, right? Go find me a million homeowners, Facebook, right? So, so you want to narrow in. And so when you're not running ads on listings, when you're not promoting open houses, what I coach and teach is run an ad on a seller guide or run an ad on a buyer guide. And, and, and that would be a, a, an ad that'd be running every day to your local area where you're simply bringing people here. And again, this applies for organic. So if you're going to go out there and just post, okay, cool. It applies for that too, because now I could be giving homeowners knowledge and really, really giving, giving value, sharing content, talking to the homeowner. And this, this could be an organic post. And again, my call to action is, Hey guys. And by the way, I put together a 2022 seller's guide that I love to give you for free. So if you click the link below, it'll take you straight to my page where you can download your free copy. Right. And that would bring them to this simple page right here. And again, everything about this, we can change. So again, these buttons are below on this page. So right below this video, you can see these, these, these funnels. Okay. So this is your basic page, seven tips. And I got a million seller guides that I can share with you guys, buyer guides. I have so many clients and everybody gives me their, their, their stuff. So 
I have a ton of them I can, I, can, I can show you as examples, but in this case, seven steps to raise the value of your home before selling, right? What every homeowner must know before selling their home. Simple, you guys, simple. You can change out the title, change out the image in the background, change out the brown color, basic editing, okay? Um, put your headshot there. And all that person does is they click, they enter their name and email, download their, the, the free seller guide. And so there, there goes tool number one, your landing page, capture the lead. Tool number two, an email would have went out right away. Hey, John, this is David. Hey, thank you so much for downloading my 2022 seller's guide. I hope you enjoy reading it as much as I enjoy writing it for you. Click here to download your PDF, right? That would have been email number one. That's your email autoresponder. And then boom, as they land here, as they land here, it's the same four bullet points. Number one, thank you. Thank you for downloading my 2022 seller's guide. Number two, introducing myself. My name is David. I'm with X Brokerage. Here's why I'm so fired up to help people sell in the greater area of San Diego, right? In this case, it's a seller guide. So I'm going to tell them, hey, man, here's why I'm so fired up to help sellers. If it was a buyer guide, then I do the same thing for the buyer side, right? So, so number two, introducing myself. And then number three, check your email because I just sent it over. It's going to be titled your 2022 seller's guide and be on the lookout for my future emails because over the next couple of weeks, I'm going to be emailing you some amazing content on what it takes to sell in today's market. So don't miss an email, right? So number three right here, you guys, simple video on my cell phone. I'm saying, hey, number three, check your email. And then number four, I'm going for the close. Number four, I'm saying, hey guys, and by the way, if you have any questions, I know a lot of people are selling right now. I'm in California. I know everyone's freaking fleeing the, fleeing the state. I know so many people are moving and I, and I know so many people have questions. So if you have anything, if there's anything on your mind whatsoever, I'd love to talk to you. So if you click the button below, it'll take you straight to my calendar where you can schedule our free call, right? And this would be a homeowner. This would be someone that just downloaded your seller guide. It's like, dude, that could be someone that's been following you and seeing your ad. They live down the street. They, they've been seeing your ad several, for several weeks now. And now, now they become indoctrinated, um, meaning that they know that they, meaning they feel like they know you. That's the thing about video. That's the thing about ads. When you, when you continue to, to, to get on people and you continue to, to market to them on their cell phone in the newsfeed, after watching you, especially if it's a video, after seeing your video several times, people become indoctrinated, meaning they feel like they know you, they feel like they can trust you, and they feel like they like you, right? Because you're on video and you're actually talking about something that makes sense. And this could this applies to anybody in any field. The fact that you're a licensed real estate professional, you're a licensed realtor, you're a licensed real estate agent, you're a broker. The fact that you're quote unquote licensed, people already put you on a pedestal. So it's like, dude, the moment you start making videos and putting them out on pages like this, people are going to start following you. Like it's absolutely insane. When people continue to see you on video, online, on social media, it builds a, a, a trust factor that is unlike anything else. That's why it's not about door knocking anymore. It's not about cold calls anymore or cold emailing anymore or, or, or whatever you guys are doing offline to build your business. It ain't about none of that anymore. It's all about running video to your local area, whether that's a Facebook ad, an Instagram ad, a TikTok ad, a LinkedIn ad, a Google ad, whatever. It's about getting in front of your audience online. Um, 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 sharing that core message and getting them to click. That's it, you guys. It's all about the click. It is all about the click. So, so in this case, I'm simply marketing a seller guide, getting that person to enter my world to schedule a call. That's it. And those that don't schedule a call on this second page, right? I showed you the listing funnel. I showed you the open house funnel. And now I'm showing you the seller guide funnel. It's all the same. The four bullet points, the messaging in this one minute video, it's all the same. I'm going for the appointment. And for those that don't schedule a call here, that's when they go into your email auto autoresponder and now they'll be dripped on. Every other day, every two days, you can set that up however you want. In fact, we'll set it up schedule a call with me. So once you activate a 14 day trial, you'll get a count. You'll get a, you'll get my calendar link where you can simply schedule our call and let's talk Kartra. Let me help you put all this stuff together. Okay. But, but the email automation is what starts to follow for is what follows for those that do not schedule a call on the second page. And so Hopefully this is making sense, you guys. Most are sending traffic to a website. That's all people are doing. And then they're wondering why they're not capturing a lead. This is what we're doing here. So 
All I want you to do is activate a 14 day trial. I have the sales funnels already done for you. You get all my time for free. As you see below, there's the email automation that will give you more information. And then, and then there's the, um, the, there's the calendar. You can click on the calendar right below this video and that'll give you more information, um, on, on the calendar. So let me walk you through real quick on how to activate a 14 day trial. Okay. So you're going to click on any, any of the buttons below, whether it's the pages, whether it's the email automation, whether it's the calendar, click on any of them and it'll bring you to this actual page page where all you're going to do is start your trial. Okay. So you'll start your trial and all you need is the monthly. Don't go annual. You just need monthly and you just need the starter for now. You just, just come over to the left-hand side, start my trial, enter your card information here, right? This is from all my doodling that I'd be doing online, um, on these forums, but, but this is the simple, um, 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 form, fill it out and then it'll take you through in fact, let me, can I even get past? Yeah, I got to get past. I can't get past the billing without really putting in my billing, but, but you guys get the idea. Once you come in here, it's really, it's, it's just a starter starting it for $1 for the 14 days. And then, and then, and then, and then sometime today by tonight, you'll get an email no later than tomorrow morning. You'll get an email from me with a link to my calendar. Okay. So schedule a call. What I have lined up for us is really three main calls. One call is to transfer all the funnels over to you, right? So I'm going to, I'm going to give you all the funnels right below on this video. You see a share code, right? So you see the share code right below. Um, so if you look at the open house funnel, the listing funnel, um, um, the, the CMA funnel, look at any of these funnels, there's the share code. Okay. So the share code is on that, is on that, um, is on that, is on that, is, is right there below on that, on that little form or whatever. Um, that's your share code. But once you activate a 14 day trial, what I want to do is I want to at least give you a few calls for free because it's all you're really going to need on this cartridge side. I want to be the one that helps you import these funnels to your account. Um, and then I want to be the one that actually puts the pages together with you. I want to be the one who helps you set up your email autoresponder. I want to be the one who actually sets up your email automation. And so, um, your, on, your online calendar and your email automation. So, so all of that, you guys, I'm willing to give you my time for free. Now check, and but, but also, 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 if we don't get a chance to schedule the call right away, don't worry about it because what I'm going to be sending you over the next few days are tutorial-based emails. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be sending you trainings on, on all this stuff, how to import the share code, how to put together your pages, how to put together your email autoresponder, how to set up your calendar, I have a ton of amazing training videos coming your way. So it all starts with the 14 day trial. So activate the 14 day trial, um, start with the starter, go through the little setup process. And then once you're in, I'll see it on my end. And that's when I'll email you my calendar and we'll go from there. All right, you guys. So, so hopefully that all makes sense. Landing pages, email automation, um, your online calendar. That's, that, that's as simple as it gets. Those are the three tools that are all in this one. And you get my support and time for free with it all, with it all, you guys. So click the button below, activate your 14-day trial, you guys, and I'll see you in your inbox. Talk to you soon.